I just wanted to post something. Um, this video, I wanted to talk about, I don't even care if the phone is moving today. I'm driving in the car. Um, Scorpio season, transformation, rebirth. I feel as though I am in a moment where... I feel as though I'm in the moment where I know exactly, I know exactly what I need to do, what I want to do, what I'm passionate about. I know where my future lies. I know all of this. I've spent the past Scorpio season understanding that transformation, um, jumping into the rebirth, like literally yeeting myself towards change because that's all I have. Did you know that I got kicked out of my apartment? Um, last week I had to move my entire apartment in less than three days. I'm, I'm not a bad person. I don't do anything. I got kicked out because I let my cousin stay at my house because she moved to Vegas and she wasn't on the lease yet because she wasn't anyway, but I'm not upset because I know that that place wasn't for me. I knew that that was temporary. And honestly, I might be moving out of state, which is really amazing. And like everything is going good now I'm in the spot and, and I'm talking about it because I went and got a reading and she told me to just talk about what's going on in life. She said, just talk about what you're struggling with. I'm like, this is my journal. This really is. I'm just going to post the content and call it a day. Did you also know that my phone is, um, I can't <laughs> see on my phone. It looks like this. Um, and yeah, so like creating, trying to create content and like do all of these stuff where I'm in the middle of houses, like staying, my clothes are at my mom's house. Um, my cat is at my, um, my best friend's house and she's got like a bunch of other animals and my cat hates it there. Um, I'm on my way from nannying and I had to let the girl miss school because she's allergic to, it's just like a lot to handle. and. I, as I started, I put on like a, a conscious cleansing heart chakra, uh, like beats, binarial beats or whatever, uh, frequencies. And, um, you know, like all I have is my craft is the ability to create content because at the end of the day, I would like to share what I got going on when it comes to understanding consciousness, understanding spirituality. I'm I am, I, I don't want to say I've stepped, I have stepped into that leadership role of teaching. Um, I've always wanted to be that person. It, it inspires me. It makes me happy. And right now I feel as though, yes, I have jumped into this new, um, energy, closed the door behind me. Honestly, my spirit team shut the door behind me and they was like, no, step into your power, ma'am. Now. I feel like as I've as we're coming toward you know as we're in like the peak of or coming toward the end of Scorpio season all that transformation we've realized what needs to be changed we realize what no longer works I'm just trying to not self-sabotage and I talk about this all the time and I started to notice how it's three 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 be yourself be true to yourself authentic um and this is true and all myself can do is just be like this and with my phone like being broken I can't do any fancy things I can't procrastinate on a video because oh I don't have the right this that and the, that this is going to get posted as raw as possible with the unedited but anyway I just, I just wanted to talk and hopefully this energetically matches someone where someone sees that they're not the only one right now I everything is going good for me just I don't have it in my material reality and because I don't have it in my material reality I'm starting to see where my ego starts to take over where I start to not trust myself and as I started to kind of like tear up because I basically because I moved out I spent so much money I spent so much money I basically like took like all of the savings that I had it's just gone and um, I babysat today or, you know, like got money and basically all the money I made from babysitting is gone because I had to pay, I had to pay some bills and I do it with gratitude. I say, you know, I pay my bills with gratitude because it'll always come back tenfold. And right now I'm in the moment of my life where things are coming a lot quicker, except this one thing and which is a monetary thing because I know exactly what's happening, but I just saw 666 as I started to, you know, spiral. And then I was like, wait a minute. No, I'm not self-sabotaging this time. I'm going to take that mindfulness that I've spent all fucking year to, to you know, like develop. And I'm going to take that to heart. And I'm going to be like, you know what, Imani? You know, you got this, dog. Because I do. So this video is to me. Um, 
I know that um I'm parallel parking the car. Give me two seconds. Um, so this message is to me and whoever needs to hear this, if everything feels good, if if like you're man, I hate the word manifestation, but if you know that you've done the work and you're just kind of like in the moment where you have to put in the work, just go for it. Just go for it. You've got nothing to lose. Imani, you have nothing to lose. Just keep going. I have so many ideas, um, so many business ideas that I would like to thrive. And I keep stopping myself because I'm like, oh, Imani, you don't have the money. No, I'm literally stopping myself from even just writing it down. And I'm not doing that anymore. And so if you just see me start posting like the most outrageous stuff, just know I'm, I'm just wholeheartedly going at it at this point. Scorpio season taught me this transformation was needed and it happened. And it's really hard, I guess, to see that transformation be like, yes, it did happen because there are certain things that still have to play out. Divine timing. Sometimes you don't get anything because what you expect, what, what you wanted is a lot bigger than what, than what you expected. Yeah. And so like there are still moving parts. I'm fine. The me now is completely different. I, and I'm telling you that right now, like even completely different from last week, because last week, you know. When I found out that I was being kicked out of my apartment, I had to be out in three days, something just clicked. And on Sunday, basically all of my energies just hit me at once. I was like running on adrenaline the past last week. My shoulders hurt, like I'm in pain all the time right now. But I feel great because I feel as though I just got rid of so much shit that no longer served me. And now toward the end of the year, I just have to finish it out, build this foundation. And in January, I plan on moving states and really jumping into this new life. So thank you, Scorpio season, for showing me this growth, this rebirth, for giving me this rebirth. Because the full moon um, happened and now it's a lunar uh, moon happening, which is like the full moon on steroids. So the, the lunar eclipse, this is the energy next week um, that we're into. It's going to be like a, a kind of preview period to what we're going to be going through for the next six months, starting in January. Um, everything right now that's happening, you're going to be seeing everything that you're working on right now. This is the energy of um, that, that's going to be amplified starting in January and going through for the next six months. So right now I'm in the energy of foundation, career, um, growth, you know, just like growing. And I am, I, I, I really am. And I, I can't stop this momentum, you know, I have to buckle down. And so, Imani, this video is for you and anybody else who just needs a reminder to keep going even though your external circumstances don't don't match, match your mind. Because they are, babes, they are. Your frequency, the frequency I'm giving off, it's gonna come. But you know, this instant gratification energy that our society in, it's killing us so i have patience right now with myself and all i can do today is draft out all those ideas i have so many great ideas and i can't wait to share them so um yeah happy Scorpio season